Hey folks, Species 7 here, welcome back to the channel, and I got another map review for you today. This is Bolasoa, or at least that's how I'm pronouncing it at the moment. <laughs> here we go, Bolasoa, Oa, Owo, there you go. Anyway, that's the name of the map, and this has the distinction of being probably the smallest map I've ever seen. <laughs> It's uh, kind of neat though. It's really, really looks good. The atmosphere here is awesome. These pigs, as cool as they look, they are actually non-functional. There are no pigs on this map. Of course, there is a pig mod. You could add them. That wouldn't be an issue. So, uh, map animation door triggers included so that you can do things like open these guys up. There you go. And in here we have, as you can see, our seeds. Heck, that in the back, a rat trap? Oh, just a bit of grass. <laughs> really calm in places like this, you'd see a little rat trap sitting in the back corner, but not this time. And etc, etc, we've got these three we can open up and have a look. There we go. And a little place to stick a small tractor or two as is this. So, other than that, we have our chickens right here, as you can see. Do -do 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 -do. Hmm. Funny looking bags, not sure what those are. We have our steaming manure pit here. Because our cow shed is here. And there's their grazing meadow. Here we have their trough. I don't believe even the water mod is on here. It's a f incredibly basic map. We have calc here. Um, the uh, kind of odd thing too is when you start the map you start with no equipment and no fields and in fact if we have a look here um, you can see we've got these stock crops um, I'm not sure what this one missing forest in 110 and EXCL blah 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 um, no, there's actually several of them. Oh, these are probably because I do have a second map installed. I think that's all that is. Yeah, okay. So ignore all the missing ones. It stops at the line. And as for places to sell, as you can see, we have the biomass plant, which buys your wood chips. We have the elevator that buys all of that stuff. And we have, well... A place called Potatoes, apparently, <laughs> that buys, surprisingly enough, potatoes. Um, there doesn't appear to be anywhere that will buy sugar beets. So, that's a little weird. So, on with the rest of the map. Across the road here, you can sell your eggs. Oh, I wanted to actually show you the map here. Because this is not the map. Alright, this just... Why this overlay, and before I add anything else, even in the mod folder, this is how the map showed up. But if we go, here we are. You see that green square? That's the map. And here's all the fields, all divided into their various little itsy bitsies. Now, according to this, we actually have some sugar beet. If that is, that might be barley. But I think it is, it's actually barley. So, not sure what we do with sugar beets. If we plant them, maybe we're just not supposed to plant them. But there you can see this outline here. Yeah, that's the actual map. And as I say, you start with no fields. And you start with no equipment. So that does make it a little awkward. So there's the other side of our farms. Here's where you can get your slurry. Um, hello, ladies. There's a greenhouse down here, but it's not functional, and then we have the water tank. Okay, so, and manure there. Uh, I actually bought this tractor to drive around, but you know what? We really don't need to. If we head this way... Doo -doo -doo -doo. Here is the one end of the map. 
And as you can see, we get a little field up there, a little field down here. Um, I think actually maybe I'm completely opposite. I think you own all of the fields right off the start. And as you can see, they are all tiny fields. Um, but you don't own any gear, so I'd advise you start with the money mod installed. Okay, that white sign is the entrance to the map, and this white sign is pretty much the exit thereof. Yeah. So, we move along here, we can see we got a few more fields, there's your meadow. I mean, some of these fields are only, you know, two runs wide. Um, well, I'm gonna hope that's potatoes, because if it's sugar beets, we're pretty much screwed. And then up here, do 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 do, nice little cornfield off to this side. You see all that stuff in the distance? Well, forget it, because you can't get to it. <laughs> there is a solid wall all the way around the little square that makes up this map, and this is that wall. Ooh, there is, uh, well, okay, maybe not so solid, but there's, uh, there's the outside world. It's scary, isn't it? Okay, we're back on the map. So, what do we get for a sell point? Well, accordingly, I don't know that this map will actually do us any good. According to that, there should be a place to sell potatoes right here. Which, of course, is, in fact, our main farm. And I'm pretty sure it does not actually have any sort of potato elevator, etc. In fact, I can't say as I've found anything in the way of an elevator so far on this map. Oh, what do you got here? Is the building condemned? Hmm. Alright. If we come out the other side, same sort of thing. We can go up here a little ways. And that just pretty much ends it. See? Field, field, field. So, <laughs> like I say, it's an incredibly simple map. Um, probably at best it would be a good candidate to put a bunch of placeables down, you know? You put in a biodiesel plant and a pellet factory and all of these things. And there we go, there's our other... Hmm. It would really be nice if at least the map agreed on the PDA. But apparently that was not made functional yet. So here we go, another field with a sneaky little entrance through the trees. And there's our girls grazing in their little tiny bit of a field. Poor cows. And beyond that, I don't think there's actually... Yeah, we have actually toured the map, by the way. <laughs> that is pretty much the entire map. So near as I can fig figure, maybe you... Well, if you dump your grains in there, you'll never get them back out again, will you? Hmm. Well, there's got to be some sort of a uh, compensation for grain storage. There's your banking. <laughs> that looks like a bank, don't it? Uh, just a blank building. We've been up there. So, um... Yeah, I'm not sure if they've just not included a cell point at all. I wonder if maybe this is just completely uh, unfinished, as it were. Because, yeah, we've been over the entire map. That is the entire map. And, yeah, I don't see any sort of cell points. So, where the ones are that are actually listed, I don't know. Um, the elevator. Hmm. And apparently we have all of these crops stored. Where the heck would we have that much stuff? 
See, because it says the elevator is right there. Which is this building. Hmm. I just don't see how this uh, would work as any sort of a silo. I mean, yeah, we could dump her stuff in here, but I don't see that that would particularly do us much good. And yeah, there's our seeds. We have a little bit of crop here, but I don't know what the heck we'd do with it. Uh, this is definitely just cow assorted stuff. Again, a bit of calc, some hay bales, some beehives. This, believe it or not, is our silage bin right here. If I bring this up, you'll see we've got compacting and fill level. So yeah, that's the actual silage pit. Uh, come through the cattle barn. Hmm. And there's our slurry. But again, as I say, I don't know where you can actually um, end up selling this stuff. Because there doesn't seem to be... Wherever this grain elevator supposedly is, doesn't actually seem to be there. Because, yeah, it's, uh, according to them, it is here somewhere. Hmm. Well... I'm not too sure that this map could be considered playable at this point if there is nowhere in fact to uh, sell your grains. Hmm, yeah, there's no sort of uh, elevator system in place here. There's not even a pipe poking out anywhere. Hmm, alright, well that is rather odd. But no, there's not, uh, like I say, there's not anywhere else. And as for this biomass heating plant, well, if we head up the road, I think we'll find that we can't actually get that far. Because it ends right here. And yeah, we're not even halfway there yet. So... According to this, the biomass plant is way the heck out there somewhere. And I have a feeling it'll probably crash the game if we try to cross this field. <laughs> so, but uh, yeah, that I'm afraid is the entire Bola Solo map. Um, yeah, at this point, I'd have to say it needs a little bit of work before we can actually do anything with it because uh, obviously what's supposed to be down here, I do like that background picture, it's kind of cool, actually isn't, right? There should be a big field there, there's obviously not, in fact, I think the map will end over there. And, uh, there's apparently some sort of a bird sticking through the back wall. But there you go, guys. Um, a neat little map, but it does indeed seem to be more a... Oof, it's just getting scary back there. More a work in progress than anything, because I'll be totally honest with you, I just cannot find any sort of tip point or sail point on here. So, not sure. <laughs> anyway, um... Yeah. I would advise, I mean, yeah, it wouldn't even be worth putting placeable heaps down to dump stuff and things, because bottom line, if we can't sell this stuff, it's not much use to us. So I think, um, hopefully I've saved you guys some time as to wasting your efforts to, whoa, I can apparently walk right in here. Um, yeah, you're probably going to find that you're wasting your efforts if you download this map because it's not complete enough to use at this time. So, um, just make sure there are no... No, there's nowhere you can pick up or drop off here. That's merely a drain spout as opposed to an actual uh, usable grain spout or anything else. So, there you go. That's been our look at the map. It... <laughs> Sorry there isn't more to it, a little bit disappointing, but like I said, 
that we put them out there whether they're good or bad you guys can decide in this case like I said I don't think this is quite in a playable condition um, there are placeable silos there are placeable heaps etc but if we can't sell our product in the end it makes it all kind of pointless so there you go that's been our review of this lovely little map hopefully it will get properly finished off one day because I do like the look of the area I like the detailing that's here um, even the kind of crazy layout of the fields is pretty neat so till next time please hit the like button guys leave your comments I will answer them and until next time take care of each other folks this has been species 7 ciao for now